Hello everyone, hope you have an amazing day and today we are here to react to the character teaser and character demo for our Lachino and <laughs> let's just say uh, it's not like I have an obsession with uh, her or anything yeah it's pretty normal so <laughs> yeah you know I have been meaning Eula since I mean for three years and this is the first time I am seriously considering <laughs> replacing her. So yeah, <laughs> I, I liked her animated short and I also liked her character. I mean, her personality and character that they have shown to us right, I mean, till now. And yeah, I am looking forward to see what kind of like, uh, what kind of name we will see in teaser and demo because the shot was from her past when she was a naive and innocent child but now that she has become this cold and ruthless killer i want to see what they are gonna show i mean which side of the name they are gonna show as they alluded in live stream so yeah i mean demo would be full of just uh, music i mean music drop and her kids so i don't think to see much action in it but yeah teaser would be lore friendly i think so yeah without any further delay let's begin well that's a nice shot to start with i'm sorry father oh i was reckless oh when I saw those emaciated patients, those poor children, mm. the futile hope in their eyes. I've told you before, uh. recklessness always leads to failure. But it was not wholly in vain. Mm -hmm. I shall settle the rest. Oh no, run, run. Leave Fontaine, I say leave ah. Tivad. Those fools. <laughs> you are they not wrong for this one. Run wealth. away. <laughs> but you will know fear of daddy. <laughs> what was that? <laughs> huh? Oh. Uh huh? <laughs> well, I like that. <laughs> That's interesting. Father. Hmm? Your face, Fremene. What we can take in face? a few more homeless children next year. Are their I've eyes still glowing? Acquired some new funds. Yeah. Oh. Okay. Oh, that was blood on. Mission us. accomplished. <laughs> okay. You can sleep now. Hmm. Thank you. I mean, she's looking worse. I'm better. Mm hmm. I'll start my next mission. Rest, rest now. Wait a second. Did she just? Oh. Hmm. Okay. Those who parade their virtues often do the most evil. I mean, that's true. You only need to we see Twitter for like this them. I mean proof of this statement. <laughs> Rest in peace, Snajevna. Hmm. My child. Yeah, Snezevna is their nickname. I mean not nickname, the last name they give to their female orphans, yeah. It's it's something like that, right? It came up in that one of the world quest I know. Yeah, no, no, not the world quest. That golden apple archipelago. Yeah. Hmm. I mean, <laughs> hey, <laughs> ten out of ten line. I mean, whoever's were always good with their. Punch lines, I mean, not punch lines, one liners, but yeah, this is the best they have used 
for quite a while <laughs> in all their games <laughs> so yeah and uh, this shot i am pretty sure what most of you guys were thinking but believe me this is scary not horny <laughs> like <laughs> this thing scares me this is not like elan's trailer right where it was just looking like an snm session right like when the cameras roll off he was i mean yelan was going to reward that for to e for spinning the beans right <laughs> you guys get my point <laughs> that i mean that teaser had that vibe going on for it not an interrogation or anything <laughs> but this one is scary <laughs> you can see see enjoys that she enjoyed doing that and that terrifies me <laughs> if but yeah i mean this thing makes much sense why she enjoyed doing this because that poor little child was already in a bad shape and i think she also knew that she, what happened <laughs> yeah and i think that she also knew that she was not going to make it so she wanted to let her child rest in peace hmm i mean such a good character man such a good character and as i have said previously during her teaser that they were pro i mean they were portraying alacino like child and wanderer by like saying that she is cold and unfeeling and betray anyone like just look at this just look Feel at this open their eyes does this look like a face of someone I've who told do that you before. or someone who is like that recklessness always leads to failure i mean just see i mean just see <laughs> and what i find funny is like people were bidding an easily impressive 5 year old and a puppet who was manipulated his whole life <laughs> i always find it funny <laughs> but yeah <laughs> uh i always believe that the real personality of the harbingers was shown in that winter night lazo trailer and uh, from that point i never felt that alacino was like what child and wanderer said and yeah this is just proving my point like she cares for her children and she would even betray saritza if she harms her children which is a good quality <laughs> so yeah and as we are on topic of saritza i also have some interesting feeling about saritza because whenever saritza gives some order she is not there it's Piero who says that so i think we have got a gender bent version of cocolia and that's piero who is manipulating our saritsa's anger towards a certain situation that happened in kandria and yeah i think there is a, a one fairy tale book talk about some pale princess or something like that so what i think happened is Saritza became like that after Kanria that Venti confirms that much i mean we know that from like version 1.0 so what happened is that pale princess should have been a cell xp or something like that and we all know what happened in Kanria so and we all know what uh, Bronya and Cell can and i mean they are known to make rash decisions when the other party is involved like safety of other party is involved So yeah I mean this is just my I'm just pulling this out of air but I think that that pale princess would have been sell and something happened to that I mean something happened to her because of all that kanria and stuff like that and she was I and yeah she also became like shogun and she also I mean started to detest celestia I mean now due to Piero manipulating her anger she is ready to start a war with Celestia and overthrow them and rewrite this whole world I think I that's like I said I I have no proof of that but yeah I mean <laughs> this is just a thing that I am getting about Saritza 
I mean, I may be right on something, I may be completely wrong, but yeah, that's the fun in this game, right? So yeah, now that we have seen her teaser, such a good teaser, like both the animation short and teaser gave a full light on how, how I mean, what her true character is and what her personality is. And yeah, such a good character. Well, it's a new day, new me and all stuff like that. And Alachino's character demo has just dropped. So let's just see what it is all about. And well, let's get ready for some cool stuff. Legend First few videos were Lord ago. friendly. The but yeah, the I expect some cool stuff in this. <laughs> okay. The children would huddle at home and light the hearth, awaiting the adults' return. Okay. Spark cannot shatter all shadows until okay. it sets all ablaze. That, that's interesting. To the other end of light, lie still bleak shades. Hmm. Oh. <laughs> okay. I mean, she is visiting all the nations. <laughs> To collect orphans, I guess. Oh, oh. <laughs> now here's the lullaby, which is entitled. <laughs> well, that's to be <laughs> okay. <laughs> That's I pretty cool transition. To play by the fireplace. So let us continue to use the name House of the Hearth. Still, its flame is no longer needed. <laughs> for you have the strength to defend yourselves. Okay. Yeah. So she has learned from her mistakes. I mean, not her mistakes, but <laughs> what happened to her in past. And yeah, interesting. It seems like she's gonna... Yeah, now it seems like the fight in her story mode is her testing out whether or not they can survive against someone as powerful as her. Yeah, right. I get the feeling from that. And it's also... Yeah, and it's also nice that all of the three, like, all of her three videos, be it rather animated short, this demo or the teaser, they all had children in some sort of a way. Like, the first one was when she was child and it has children chorus where during the finale and her demo, I mean, yeah, her teaser was all about her house of hearth and also her demo contains a lullaby, so <laughs> yeah, it's pretty interesting. And so yeah, both her teaser and demo didn't disappoint and yeah, there was some pretty cool shit in this <laughs> demo and yeah, I really, really like this one too. So yeah. I hope you guys also enjoyed this video. 
and I'm gonna pull, I mean, post my Alakino pulls tomorrow. And yeah, no, she needs new boss, right? I was gonna say that I would also do some team and yeah, I mean, Alakino showcase and stuff like that. But then I remembered that <laughs> her boss also drops tomorrow. So yeah, I haven't pre, I mean, no one can pre farm for her. And her weekly boss would be herself so yeah i won't be able to crown her also i mean i also won't be able to crown her till next pet so yeah it is what it is <laughs> so yeah so tomorrow there will be i mean there will only be a latino pools so yeah see you guys tomorrow bye <laughs>